Ideate is where we start to create our solutions. It's where we start to play and brainstorm. We take our barrier and turn it into an intervention. An intervention is essentially just a solution in the behavioral design language, where we're talking about a solution that actively changes someone's behavior. We pull all the brainstorming techniques and approaches from design thinking, but this isn't normal ideation. This is behavior-backed ideation, which means that we are going to take a deep dive into behavioral science. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. It's going to feel different and it might feel a little bit difficult, but we're going to make the steps simpler and we're gonna use a process and a method called the behavior change wheel, which was created from 19 behavior change frameworks by Professor Mitchie and team to take people from diagnostic to intervention. And we've already started using it. COMB, if you remember from Reacts of Audience, is at the core of the behavior change wheel, which means you've already taken one step in, so we may as well carry on. Now what's unique about the behavior change wheel is it's self-selecting. So the insight from COMB will self-select the next bit which is called intervention function. The intervention function are broad categories of intervention types. They are taken from the behavioral science base, categorized and broken into key categories. So these are things like incentivization and persuasion. And what you'll do is you'll use your insight from Combi for the barrier that you've identified and start to self-select the intervention function. Once you've selected the intervention function, you can then self-select the next stage, which are behavior change techniques. And behavior change techniques are 93 techniques from behavioral science interventions that are reliable and work. This means the entire process is so much simpler than you could have thought it was going to be. And in actual fact, all you'll do is select maybe five out of five or six, depending on your intervention function, and then start making a solution of them. Over ID8, we will use the behavior change wheel process. I've broken it down into individual little steps and paired it with either a template or an activity to help you. So look out to download them as you go. Good luck.